Yo, back again. Pink Reaper with more of this bullshit. Uh, this is the first time I'm not recording at, like, goddamn forever o'clock at night, so uh, I'm gonna sound just a little bit more awake than I normally do. It's like... It's still kind of late. It's like, uh, what time is it right now? It's almost 11 p.m., but, you know, that's a lot better than the 3 a.m. I was recording at the other night. Oh, that's gonna... I hate whenever I want to wipe something off the screen that happens. It's so fucking annoying. Um, I forgot what we were doing. <laughs> like, literally, I started the last recording, and I just, like, went to... I started recording this, and then I went to Yoka area... <laughs> And then, uh, as it turned out, that's not where I was supposed to be going, so, uh, I just restarted this recording, so, I, like, I just, I don't know, man. Never record late, like, that's the, that's the, that's the new plan. I'm gonna sword this guy, watch. Bitch! Dude, this folder is so bad. Bubble Man's gonna whoop my ass. I don't have, like, anything that can hit the third fucking... Wait, are they on the top floor or the bottom floor? I don't even remember. I feel like they're on the bottom floor, though. Okay, cool. <laughs> if you guys were up there, I was just gonna restart this fucking recording again. Um, I have, like, nothing that can hit, uh... Like, the back row. Uh, I have no back row hate. You know. No MST. No, uh... God damn it, you're both still alive? Okay, well, this is gonna kill you. Oh, wait, I can't hit that now. And also, it's not going to kill you. Oh, this is obnoxious. Uh, no, area grab wouldn't even help. Dude, I don't know. What am I going to do here? Now, that should kill that guy. The one in the back, right? Yeah. I have made a mistake. Okay, he's dead. Oh wait, you get chipped out for that fight? Yo, I could have gotten Ice Wave 2. Uh... Oh wait, I don't need to jack out, because they should be going to... Yoka, ba Yoka Area 3 again, right? Yeah, Yoka 1. I always forget that, like... The... I always forget that, the, like, the areas that you initially jack in from aren't always, um, like, the area ones. Um. In fact, it's, like, it's only areas that, like, you have, um, a PC connected to. Did I buy one of these already? Yo, I'm not gonna look in my, my folder. I need someone who's watching these videos to comment on this one to tell me whether or not I already bought Yo-Yo 1G in a l older episode, because, like, I'm not going to check my folder right now. I just need y'all to tell me. <laughs> and if I don't have it, I'll go back and buy it again. God damn it. I should I should just untrap when I'm here. I should just do it. Yo. Punk, solve all my problems. Yo. Imagine if I remembered how to use Punk. Like, that ship would be so much better. I just know that if you stand on the back one, he does that wave shit. I don't know how to do, like, the double hit or anything like that. Yo, something I noticed while just kind of, like, playing the game is... One of the, like... One of the audio channels for the actual music is shared with... Um... Is shared with... The... Uh... Audio channel for... Oh, shit. I, I need to not... There we go. The audio channel for sound effects. Um, which means when sound if like when you have random sound effects happening, like if I were to do this, uh it overwrites certain notes that are that play in the actual song. Um like those little beeps that you hear in the background of the music, the ding doon ding doon bullshit or whatever. Um, like, that shares the same audio channel. I'm not doing this fight. Dude, fuck penguins. I don't. Don't actually fuck penguins. Don't fuck penguins. Don't fuck Mickey Mouse. And please, for the love of God, do not fuck Isabel. Like, seriously? What is wrong with you fucking degenerates? Like, 
let the poor little dog, like, let the poor little dog live her life. Uh, this fight looks like it's gonna suck some righteous ass. I'm gonna try and kill at least one of you. Hey, I got... Maybe I can kill two of you. Nope. I should be safe here. Granted, I've severely limited my ability to hit them, so, you know. That's cool. Let's do this and see if this works. Yeah, don't care. Uh, okay, so it only hit... Oh, I didn't realize that that works with the stone that's in my own... Um, like, my own area. Okay, I should be able to get a kill if he just moves down. Please move down. You know what? You want to keep doing it that way? Bullman works this way, too. Look, man. Happy Feet sucked ass and you deserve to die. That's not true. I've never seen Happy Feet. I mean, maybe he deserves to die. And maybe Happy Feet sucks ass. Maybe that statement was, in fact, true. I have no actual proof of that. Oh, my God. What? I said something about Untrap and then I just didn't do it. Um... I'm gonna let you go up. Yeah! So this is one of the, like, this is, honestly, this along with Gaia Blade is, like, the only usable elemental chip. Um, what is it? Salamander, um, and, uh, Fountain, or whatever the hell the other one's called. Like, they're not good. Um, they just, like, they're not, so, it's worth noting that this is the best one. And even this one's not amazing. Um, Gaia Blade is just a wide sword, so it's incredibly limited. But it's a wide sword you can pump up to be very, very strong. Um, I'm going the wrong way. Um, like you can, you basically it. Uh, you use you select wide sword. F you select wide sword, and then any chips that you select after it, the power of those chips are added to the power of wide sword, and then those chips just aren't used. So, like, if I put Wide Sword plus four copies of, um, I don't know, what's a strong chip? Um, no Beam 3, which is, like, what, uh, 210 power or something like that? Um, it would add 640 power to the power of Gaia Blade, which, you know, not bad. Um, the problem is, of course, that, like, you can only run one Gaia Blade and one Gaia Sword. Um, they're the same exact chip, it's just one has slightly higher base power than the other, so... Okay, let's see what we got. Uh... I should almost kill him. Uh... Ugh, Punk won't kill him is the problem. The thing is, I can just do this forever. Like, I can just sit here and not die. Also, hold on, I need to... So, this is a crab with one giant claw and one eye. But, like... When I was a kid, and even, like, literally as an adult, I should point out. Like, not just when I was a kid, also when I was an adult. I had no fucking clue what this is supposed to be. Like, I thought it was facing forward, and that was the, like, one of its two eyes on the side of its head. And it just had this huge fucking, like, mohawk-looking thing on its head. I'm like, I don't know what this is, but I don't like it. Hey, you should move up. Thank you. Easy win. God damn it. Wow, I S ranked that. Okay. <laughs> me. I have no way of fighting Bubble Man. Me. S ranks him anyway. Uh, Go the fuck to sleep. Is that what happens next? Yo, Mom. How were you when everyone was fucking dying? Like, literally the whole world was going to shit. What was my email here? Uh, No. Oh, that's right. 
I guess we're not saving. Yeah, he's gonna win, except he's not, because no one wins. Uh... Okay. I wasn't sure if I had to read that or not. Apparently I didn't. I think I can jack into this now. I feel bad the last episode was the the first episode I uploaded where I didn't just, like, fight an, a World 3 boss at the very end of it. But, goddamn, I was so tired. I do not remember anything about the last episode. Like, at all. I was in a drunken stupor from lack of sleep. This quarantine's kicking my ass, by the way. Like, I'm not, I'm not allowed to talk about it. I'm not even allowed to say COVID or Corona or, uh... I'm sure there's other words, I just can't think of them right now. Um, did I go in here and get the thing? I feel like I did, so I'm just going to ignore it. Um, yeah, so here's Gaia Sword. Oh, no, no, no. The difference between Gaia Sword and Gaia Blade is actually just, like, one is a long sword and one is a... Um, one is a long sword and one is a wide sword, and that's it. Trying to think, it's like, would it even be worth getting? Nah. Oh, cool. Let's head to the beach during a quarantine, which let's not, I guess. Never mind. Oh, right. It's the beach area. Hold on. Okay, I don't need to actually do anything. Uh, in that case. Go to Scilab. Dude, they should just, like, let you sleep in... Who the fuck are you guys? Uh, they should just let you sleep in Scilab. Because, like, all of the interesting stuff happens here. Did I... Yeah, I did. Okay. Or not all the interesting stuff, but really it's just, like, this is the e this is the, the hub of moving around the, the fucking internet. Like it's got the it's got the closest uh, like train station, cyber train station, whatever the fuck. Uh, as well as once uh, Drillman opens up the whole, that's not where I wanted to go. Oh, holy shit! I forgot something. Ugh. Fuck this game and its weird sequence of events. That's a joke. This game's great. Um, I have a lot of good things to say about this game. In fact, I constantly say good things about this game. I feel like I should complain more about this game. Can't go that way. All right. Because there are things this game is... Okay, really? I, I have to do it via the internet? That's annoying. Uh, let me think here. I can't go to Melu's house either, right? No. Okay. Uh, I'm trying to sequence this as... What would the fastest way to do this be? Uh, okay. I think I know. Yeah, there are some, like problemish things in this game. A lot of it's, like, incredibly nitpicky. Um, like, the inability to take more than one um, help board quest at a time, and the fact that if you take a help board quest, you can't cancel it. Um, that's annoying, but it's not like, I mean, obviously it's not like, oh no, this game is unplayable. Um, if anything, I'd say the one thing that's, like, honestly kind of an issue like an actual issue that doesn't really get brought up much uh but uh, you could call it you could consider it a real issue or i do consider it a real issue is the fact that um you can't it's it's literally not possible to get every standard chip uh before you 
before you beat the game. Um, in fact, it's not even possible to get a lot of the standard ships. Where am I going? I forgot Melu's PCs over here. Uh, it's not possible to get a lot of the standard ships before um, the end of, like, the quote-unquote end of the game before you, you beat Alpha. Um, and, like, I get it, like, it incentivizes you to explore the, you know, the last area. There's, you know, new stuff there that you couldn't get before, but, uh, like, I feel like a better way to do it would have been to have, like, the viruses that only appear in the, um, the secret area also appear in specific other areas under certain conditions. Like, uh, like, so, I mean, that that's already a thing, right? Like, if you use the, the fish, the, um, the fish jungle, you know, whatever programs, the ones that, um, make you more likely to run into certain enemies of a specific element. Um, I really never got the side gun. All right. Um, if you use that, um... In certain areas, like, rare and, in fact, powerful enemies can show up um, to allow you to get chips that you wouldn't normally be able to get um, at that time. Okay. Um, they should have had that... They should have had that work as well for, um, like, stuff that only appears in... Um, the secret area. And the thing is, like, the secret area still has, like, viruses that don't appear anywhere else. Um, they've got, like, the upgraded shadows and the, uh, the scuttleist viruses, which, you know, that's cool. Just keep those viruses in the game there, uh, as unique ones, because their drops are things that, like, uh, for the scuttleists, it's an, it's a mega chip drop, which is fine if you want to have mega chips that only drop after the game ends. Like, that's totally fine, because you've also got bosses that you don't fight until after that, and they still drop chips. Um, and then, I swear to God, if I had to go to Dex's PC before doing this, I'm going to be pissed off. Um, but then, like, you can still also have, like, the high tier enemies there, just have them, you know, spawn more frequently, like... Don't have Ratty 2 spawn, which do spawn in Secret Area 1. Instead, only have Ratty 3s. Um, things like that. I don't know. Um, the, the reason... the reason My reasoning for this is just because that... Um, without access to those chips, it can be hard to like do proper folder building before you've beaten the game, really. Um, or it's, it can be hard to make like a really good competitive kind of folder um like for instance i'm you know all out all in on getting oh my god i really dude i hate this game Ugh. all right well the fastest way to get to dex's pc is actually to go through scilab and then that'll also be a quick way to get back to yoka that's fucking obnoxious this is dumb this is this is the other thing like there, there are a couple instances where, like, in order to spawn a Navi, you have to go talk to another Navi. Like, it's not like in order to access an area you couldn't access before you have to talk to a specific Navi. It's in order for, you know, like, X Navi to appear, you have to talk to Y Navi in an area you can already go to anyway. Like, it's just, I don't know. It's needless busy work, in my opinion. Um... It's padding, which this game doesn't really need. This game is very big. Um, if you count all of the post-game content, which I do, like, the post-game content adds a solid, like, five, six hours to the total playtime. Um, I mean, less if you've pre-grinded all your chips, I guess. Um, and then, as I talked about before, I don't like how... Um, I don't like how the navvies that don't really have a, like, their own specific area just sort of needlessly make you go through all of the areas you've already been to before a couple different times. Um, 
Bubble Man makes you go through the three areas you've been to. First you go to Yoka, then you go back to ACDC, then you go... Or, no, first you go to Yoka, then you go to ACDC, then you go to Scilab, then you go back to Yoka. Um, which is all just, like, needless. And then Flame Man just has you go to all four areas again, even though you, like, to put out fires. Which is just... Uh, and the thing that gets me, too, is... There's no real good reason for it to be that way. Um, I, I feel like a better way to do it would have been to have... Because you put all these fire programs in Scilab. Uh, it would have been better to just have... Like... A, a specific area of Scilab that you get to... Like... Enter in... Specifically for like that... For fl the, the Flame Man thing. Like... So you can't enter, you can't enter the Scilab, Sci um, proper, be, like, in the real world, because obviously it's on fire. But, like, what if there was, like, some sort of secret back door that Lan's dad lets him know about that he can enter? Um, so, like, you have that, and it's also on fire, and you have to deal with that. Um, email. Alright. Um... And then it gets you into the Scilab, like, Scilab proper, and then you fight Flame Man there. Like, that would have been cool. Um, or even maybe you just chase him out, and he goes into uh, the Undernet from there, and you still have to go to the Undernet. That's fine, but at least, like, I mean, it, it, intro it introduces the, the Undernet there, and that's fine. But then also you didn't have to just go through the entire regular net. Like, I don't know. Just, just a thought. And the thing that gets me too is that, like, it seems like, I mean, for the most part, it doesn't seem like that's, like, like they were, it, it doesn't seem like they were cutting corners or anything like that. This game has a lot of areas. This game has a lot of content. This game has, like, it really doesn't feel like they, like, it, it doesn't feel like a Pokemon game where... They're like, yeah, there's this huge area that's going to be uh, enterable soon, except it's actually never enterable. You can never go in there. Uh, what's up, Yorts? Uh, that didn't work. I'm dead. Holy shit. I was trying to do the uh, hero sword, and... Uh, it, uh, it did not work. I almost died. That went poorly. Alright. Now I'm less dead. Which is important. Fishy, fishy, trumpy. Oh, do I need... No, I don't think I do. I feel like I need a, a fanfare chip at some point or something, but I also feel like I don't. So. Virus? Gut straight. Also, big shout outs to uh, this well designed part of the internet wherein you can't. Uh, you can't progress without a compression program. Like, dude, the, f the future internet sucks ass. And that's not even, oh, also shout outs to this piece of mystery data that I somehow missed as a kid. Uh, I remember when I was a kid, I was like, one of my friends had more like, he had more reg memory than I did, and I couldn't figure out how or why. And then one day I just sort of noticed that there was blue mystery data there that I had never got. Just, I just somehow ignored it entirely. And I'm like, alright, cool, I'm dumb as fuck. <laughs> I was like, I'm gonna pretend that didn't happen. Alright, what do we got here? Cuss sword. Bet your ass we're getting that. Alright. 
Alright, what are we taking out, boys? Uh, I feel like I should take out the attack 10s. They don't really do anything, but they're asterisk. So, like, I also feel like I shouldn't. Uh, let's just take out a regular sword. That's a... Oh, wait, that was Cuss Sword. What am I thinking? I'm dumb. I thought that was a Var Sword. I'm incredibly stupid. Wow. Just... Oh, hey. Yo, yo, 1G. I do have it. God damn it. I hate myself. Wait, I have another White Sword L? Whatever. That works. Whatever. When did I get another White Sword L? I do not remember. Uh, is there? No, there's not. I thought there was... I thought there was blue mystery data down there. I was incorrect. Wow. I can't believe I really just bought a custom sword. That is going to be completely useless because you won't even see Proto Man in this playthrough. That's just a spoiler, I guess. If you really want to see... If you really want to see... Uh, <laughs> if you want to see... If you want to see... Proto Man in this playthrough, smash that like button and get us to 10k likes. Don't actually do that. Uh, I don't give a shit. Um, if you want to see, if you want to see Proto Man that badly, I will load up my Mega Man Battle Network 3 Blue fo file where I am standing directly in front of him, and I will send him to the fucking Shadow Realm as I always do. Like my. Uh, my my battle network th my 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 battle network three blue file literally just exists to beat up on Proto Man. Oh hey, I got it. I literally just put that stone block there because I was like, hey, what if I what if I just happened to get uh, lightning? And I did. Also occurs to me I probably should have bought um, the other one. Uh, thunder or whatever or bolt um, from Higsby just because I mean I could use it it's it's probably better than fucking one of the bull man chips oh please work please work yes thank god Any fight that has a trumpian it annoys me. I'm going to go ahead and do that just because it's technically more power. Oh, yeah. Uh, speaking on speaking of bad things in this game, this shit, the shit with the like one way can the one way conveyor belts. That's goddamn annoying. And uh, actually, you know what? I just want the damage on you more than anything. Oh, hey, cool. It even killed the Trumpy. Um, I'm going to go ahead and put this here. The main reason is if one of them tries to area steal, it will stop them. Oh, I wasn't invincible there. Yeah, like that. Yeah, these one-way conveyor belts that, like, right here it's it's kind of annoying the first time you ever come to the beach area because you don't know which way is the correct way to go. But it's really fucking annoying in the undernet. Let's just go ahead and skip all of these cutscenes. All right. Dad something Scilab. Alright, fair enough. Dude, when do I get to go to the beach? Literally, the only reason I want to go to the beach is so I can get the money. I can go gamble again and just get money. Get that money. Hey, did you guys know Hulu had live sports? This is not the correct place to go. I'm so, like... 
I'm so dialed into just going to Scilab to jack in to go to the internet. Uh, it's you, right? Alright, cool. And then we run into Dad, and then I think we just go to bed, right? Like, yeah. <laughs> like, that's the whole event. Good use of your time, Lan. Yeah, that's the whole day. What a fucking weird... What a weird sequence. I mean, it's... The thing that gets me is, like, it, it makes sense. Not every day is gonna be full of, like, random insane shit happening, right? Um, yeah, okay. Now I can actually go to Beach Street. Oh, but the fucking hospital's gonna be... God damn it. Right? Yeah, I can't go to the hospital. God damn it. But my money's... Let's go ahead and jack into this car. I would like to point out that as a kid, I found every version 5 Navi on my own. Uh, and it sucked ass. Specifically because uh, Desert Man is in this fucking car instead of being anywhere in the TV station. Which would have made more sense. Fucking Desert Man. Arms. Shoutouts to Twin Tails Booty. Yo, see, okay. Like... Nintendo creates Twintail, quite literally the hottest ass to have ever graced, like, at least a Nintendo console. I don't know, two Bs out there, so, you know, it's, it's kind of hard to decide uh, who has the greatest ass, period. But, uh, Nintendo creates Twintail, and yet everyone on the internet wants to jerk it to fucking Isabelle. Like, come on, guys. Alright, let's do at least a solid amount of damage. Kingman has always been an incredibly annoying fight. Uh, area grab is actually completely worthless. I'm gonna do it anyway, though. Alright, come on, man. I just need something that can hit him so he dies. Alright. Um, Alright, he should be dead here. I also don't know how you counter-hit Kingman. Like, I know one way you can do it, which is you have to wait for his checkmate attack, which is annoying as hell. But I don't know that you can do it any other way, which is kind of dumb. Oh, wait, right. It's the introduction thing. And then Chod's not there, and then I have to go find Chod. Let me go up here. I want, I want money. Also, why can't I jack into this? I got mail from, from who? Oh, I don't give a shit. Oh, wait, actually, he sends me something. Definitely want that. Oh. And is this where I get roll three? No, it is not. Okay, never mind then. Wait, is this not the part where... No, I guess it's just... I go straight to Hades Island. Okay, whatever. Let me on. Oh. You know the shit's on the level when they fucking drug all of the participants. Oh, I forgot to buy fish. Can I leave? No, I can't. Fuck. 
I forgot to buy fish. I meant to buy fish when I was at the, uh, the beach square. So that while I was here, I could just get Ice Ball M. And now I'm gonna have to do it later. Fuck my life. I've always wondered what happens. If I fail this, can I just skip this entire part of the game? Like, I really don't want to do this part. Okay, Boomer. I actually legitimately forgot that I already had the Hades folder equipped. So I was just like, uh, what's going on? Oh, wait. God damn it. I forgot. I don't want to do this fight. I have to do this fight. Never mind. Sorry, get used to seeing me move up and down, because, like... Oh, my lord. Counter hit. I'm so good. If this was Battle Networks 4 through 6, I would have just gotten full synchro. Uh... I guess that's something I can talk about. Because um, I... You know what? Because I recorded so fucking late, I don't remember if I ever brought up the fact that, like, later gen... Later gens? Later games... Oh, fuck. I actually can't avoid this fight just because of that fishy too. That's annoying. Um, later games, like... Don't have... Um, like, great ways of dealing damage... Um, in terms of, like, chips. Hold on, I gotta... I gotta not die. Give me a second here. Okay. Um, but they do have full synchro, which doubles the damage of your next attack. So, I mean, theoretically, you can do a huge amount of damage. But even then, who fucking cares? Like... The fact that you have to do just, like, additional setup... Can I hit either of these guys? I can hit the one in the back, right? Yeah, I can hit that one. Unfortunately, I can't hit this guy, because I can't move back. Uh, this can hit, though. I think almost... Hey, I got another Yo-1G. Nice. I think almost every full or chip in this folder is something I didn't already have. Like, there's a couple things in here I definitely had, but for the most part, all new, man. Let's get that double KO. Not right here. This is going to be a single KO, and this is going to be a double KO. Heat shot J. That shit's going straight to energy change later. Cool, I got the Hades key. Alright, I'm done. Peace.